I did promise you over the weekend that I would try salt dough and I did. So I took a little video of myself doing it. I will post that online a little bit later, but I've got my creations here. Okay. So in this bag, there is, you know, very beautifully wrapped in a tea towel, <laughs> my first creation made out of salt dough. All you do basically is you get flour and salt and water and it's twice the amount of flour as it is to salt and water. You mix it all together, make a dough, shape it into something, bake it for three hours. Yeah, you've got to be patient. Uh, and then you get something that you can paint. So my first thing that I made, I'm hoping the camera will pick this up, I made because it's, you know, everyone's being very nationalistic at the moment in a great way. I made a Triscoll, a three legs of man. And this is partly inspired by the post office at the minute, encouraging everyone to put Manx flags in their windows. And there's loads that have appeared. So I thought I'd make a, a, a three legs. So that's my first effort. And then I had a bit of dough left and I looked over at the desk and I basically saw something, pointed at it and went, all right, I'll make one of them then. And there was a picture of a pineapple on my desk. So I then decided I'd make a pineapple. So there you go. I've taken a video of me showing off my wares here. I will post it online a little bit later on. But I'd love you all to have a go and share your photos of what you've created with us as well. You can send them to us, latelunchamaxradio.com. Get the kids involved. Honestly, it's so much fun. And the anticipation of waiting for it to, to bake and then dry and then cool down so you can paint it. It is brilliant and super, super easy. 